we've talked about type 2 diabetes and a lot of people may not know that they're down that road or, or headed that direction. What are some of the biggest risk factors of letting it go untreated, you know, down the road? What happens and what are some of the, the concerns? Yeah, so the most common complications of type 2 diabetes include um, changes to, to our, our really vulnerable vascular beds, that is these collections of blood vessels that supply blood and nutrition to various organs. And so the ones that are most vulnerable are our eyes, and so we think about retinopathy or changes to the retina, and um, those changes impact vision, um, vision becomes blurry, people often lose vision, and um, type 2 diabetes is the number one cause of, of blindness in the adult population. Um, so retinopathy or vision complications increases risk for cataracts or sort of the clouding of the lens of the eyes um, leading to cataract surgeries and, and whatnot, uh, ultimately lens replacements. Um, the kidney complications or uh, nephropathy are another common complication and so this is when the, the vascular bed of the kidney um, becomes uh, chemically modified to where the each vessel actually narrows to the point of not being able to filter out proteins as well as it's supposed to. And um, so we, we see renal complications. Type 2 diabetes is the number one cause of, of um, chronic renal disease and ultimately end-stage renal failure requiring dialysis. This is one of the reasons why the costs are so high that uh, dialysis is expensive, it's sure. high maintenance, and, um, and unfortunately paid for by our federal health care system. So our healthcare system gets the brunt of a lot of those costs. Probably the complication that bothers patients the most are the changes to the nerve fibers. Um, we call these uh, neuropathies, and neuropathies um, result in uh, often in, in pain or odd sensations, things like numbness and tingling, loss of sensation, um, usually happens in the legs and the periphery first. Um, but that neuropathy process actually can happen to any nervous, any nerve fiber in the body including the nerve fibers to our, 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 our organs, our main organs, like our heart and our digestive tract. So um, neuropathies to the heart can cause cardiac arrhythmias or abnormal rhythms of the heart. And neuropathies to the gastrointestinal tract can cause um, sluggish transit time in the bowel and ultimately can cause uh, gastroparesis or an actual paralysis of the um, intestines of the gut. And that can be very ser serious and require uh, surgery to uh, repair obstructions and remove obstructions. Mm -hmm. So you can see that really all nerves and all vascular systems are, are really vulnerable to the changes that happen with diabetes.